I see Rust-Oleum makes a uh, topside paint, and I'm going to see if it will hold up in the marine environment. Everything I got, I run in the ocean, all salt water and everything, and so uh, I really haven't heard of too much about it, so we'll give it a try. I'll let you know how we make out. Let's see how she does. It don't smell too bad. It has the smell of oil-based paint. That's all. We'll let that set and see how it does. It's been a while. That's soaked in pretty good. Um, uh, it says apply one coat and leave it set overnight and then sand it and do your next coat. So we'll let it set and see how it goes. Okay, here's our board this morning. I really soaked in a lot. You heard it, it's time to start. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sand it down. We'll give it another coat. Next time I use a roller pan. I didn't have a little one, so I worked out again. But There it goes. That's it. That's the second coat. <clears throat> we'll see what it dries like. And uh, just to give you some idea, I bought a quart of it. 
and between this piece and my other pieces I was doing, I only showed you the one, but uh, all the wood together would have been equivalent to a 4x8 sheet of plywood. And it give everything one coat and probably and then half a, half a sheet again and then that's, that's pretty much it for the cork.
fight must be getting dull, dull, and more dull.